Here at City Hall, I'm our senior project manager, but I'm also our safety director. I ensure that projects are done not just on time, but also safely. Here at City Hall, having a senior level project manager heavily invested in safety is something other companies don't have. I think it's unique to City Hall construction. It makes me proud to come in every morning and work on safety, not just projects and schedules and budgetary means that we have to meet here at City Hall, but also safety. The safety me here, here at City Hall aren't just about safety, they're also about leadership. We try to teach leadership to all of our people. Leadership is very important. It's a team effort, but everybody's a leader on that team. Just not the foreman and the superintendents, but also a laborer. The lowest guy on the totem pole when it comes to safety is also a leader. So we try to preach that to our guys and instill it. And everybody at six o'clock in the morning on Tuesdays, everybody really enjoys that because they all feel part of the team. They all have a voice when it comes to safety. It's not just me talking to them. We try to get interactive. We try to get people involved and they do. They like it. They like being a part of our safety program. But when it comes to safety, everybody's a leader in our opinion here. We go through all types of trainings. You know, it could be a job safety analysis type of training where it's a JSA and it's a daily thing or it may be a specific thing that we're talking about that day. It could be communication, making communication a part of safety. It could be don't text and drive, operating equipment safely. It could be a lot of different things. It might be a task we're doing that we might be doing a demolition job and we really need to focus on that demolition job that day or that week. But mainly we try to incorporate multiple aspects of construction into our safety meetings.